I asked Sandy an important question. You want more candy or to ride the Haunted Mansion? And Sandy says... More candy. More candy. Stay tuned for this one. Let's boo this, Mickey. Why are people lined up so early, Sandy, out here? They're smart. <laughs> they want to get in right at 4 o'clock and make the most of their party. Yeah, party time may start at 7, but like Betty says, actually, you can get into the Magic Kingdom at 4 o'clock. Yeah, they don't start letting you in. If the park yeah. opens at 4 o'clock, Sandy, how early should we get here to wait in line? Well, we There's a lot of people. There really is. Now, this is our, what, third? No, fourth? Fourth. Fourth Halloween party. And we got here this time about 10 after 3. Right. So last here. time we came, though, it was madness. And I think we got here around 4 o'clock. Right. So no, right actually, now, yeah. right now, we are real close to the ticket people, about 6, 7 deep. But behind us, and it only took like 5 minutes. And it sold out tonight. It's 3.48, we're baking out here, but they've already started letting people into the party. Once entered, just see any of these, and they have wristbands that they're gonna get you to let people know you're members of the party. Welcome, happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. There is so much to do at Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. There sure is. How do you choose what is your favorite and what do you do within the time period that you have while you're here? So, we thought we'd go over our top things to do and hope you agree. If not, or you think of others, put it in the comments down below. But Sandy, let's get ready to go on this Halloween-filled Adventure That Rocks. As soon as you enter the Magic Kingdom, you cannot help but get into that Halloween spirit. Let's take a closer look at some of these. Play ball! Right in the center, you'll find an excellent shot to take a photo between these two pumpkins, highlighting the castle in the background. What do you think Chef is cooking up? Pumpkin pie? I believe she has done some shopping in the Main Street Emporium. First walk in, you're gonna see that they kind of encourage you to go to the right hand side because that is where you're gonna pick up your trick or treat bags and start the fun and the madness. <laughs> Thank you. Let's boo this. And Sandy's been getting recognized as Betty Rubble. Our bag is open, our bag is ready. Thank you. And M&M's already in there. Look at that, Sandy, it's only like five after four. We already got trick or treat bags and candy. And water. Yes, and water. So it is really hot out here. Sandy says it's 110, I say it's 98. So what we're gonna do is take a break, go on the carousel of progress, get rejuvenated on the air conditioning, and then bring on the party. What do you say? Sounds like a plan. Let's go. And you're gonna see a lot of costumes, like the tightrope girl from the Haunted Mansion. Change of plans. We said we were gonna go do Carousel of Progress, but when Buzz Lightyear is a five minute wait, ride number one begins. Who will win? Sandy or me? Betty or Fred? Boom, look at that, look at that, look at that. Nice job. Buzz Space Ranger. Yeah. Let's keep in mind, I got that yeah. score with Sandy cheating. I was trying to spin it. She and spins she it every magic. time I, she knew I had a good target aim lined up. She hit that spin button and made my camera go all over the place. It'll work this time. Ride number two, one of Disney's favorites, Carousel of Progress. Ride number three. Oh, it's three, yeah. All aboard the People Mover. Rides. The rides are definitely open during Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, and some of them have cars. They do give you one of those guides that has all the locations for treats and everything that's going on. It has the location of all the treats and everything that's going on. Look at all this. We don't need that. Hey, do you know where the apple? Uh, no. How about the zombie fingers? Uh, no. How about the cold brew? Uh, 
No. Yeah, that's why we didn't Here. Astro Orbiter's only a 10 minute wait. Astro Orbiter, the app said 10 minutes. The sign out front said five minutes. And it's rare we ever get to do this without a line. So we're going to go yabba dabba do it. If you weren't aware to get on Astro Orbiter, you've got to enter through the elevator. On the Astro Orbiter. Ride number like five, is it? I don't know. Maybe four. Costumes! You will notice practically everybody is dressed in costumes, including us. Yeah, so throughout the video, we're gonna show you some of the costumes people are wearing out here. I think that'll be fun. Yeah, and be sure to check out Instagram and Facebook for some of the fun costumes that we captured via photo and reels. And we'll put those links to the description down below. Oh, they have a Megara. Megara, I mean. Where? Megara. Where? Where? That's not the real. She, Where? She, she, she was Where? dressed up, but it was her. I've wanted to meet Megara like forever. That's not the real one. Like, just somebody dressed up like her. I'll look. It's going to be a fun costume for one time. Where is she? Yeah, she's behind the elevator. Okay, they come. What a there. team. Okay. 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 Let's try check out some of the other costumes. Oh, that's the Halloween tree. Yeah, that's the Halloween tree. Yeah, that's the Halloween tree. Let's check out some of the Halloween treats at the Cheshire Cafe. One thing to note, there are some locations that will not serve the Halloween goodies until the actual party time. But look around and you might get lucky like at the Cheshire Cafe and get your Halloween treats before the party. Yeah, so, I kinda want one of those Cheshire cattails too, but I didn't see the mummy. Did you see the mummy? Maybe the drinks are available. Maybe the mummy is not available. We'll find out. Serving them right now. Yes. Sandy was correct. You can only get the Witch's Cold Brew and the Queen of Hearts slushy and not the mummy tail finger thing. Not yet. Fuel for stand up to midnight on a Sunday night. Look at that. A pumpkin cream right on top. Cold brew. Too bad we can't shake it. Well, you could shake it. I could shake it. Ooh, I might need some sweetener in that one. Not sweet enough for me. Why is everybody cheering inside Space Mountain, Sandy? Yeah, because they made an announcement that they're going to shut their lights off in the dark. And it is only 6.30, I think, right now. Yeah, we got a line at 6.15 just because. And so there's another tip. The lights might get turned off super early on Space Mountain. Why can't we get any footage on Space Mountain to show the people, Sandy? Complete darkness. Like, you couldn't see a thing. Only on the very top. Oh, yeah. You got to see a light. very light shadow, and then, yeah, total darkness. Ah! Food! During the Halloween party, they actually have special food that you can only get during the party. Let's check some of it out. Like, I didn't call you. I meant the food. You said, okay, never mind. Anyway, yeah, so what was the name of my sandwich? It was a chicken sandwich. You had the twice spice chicken sandwich okay. or something like that here at Cosmic Grace. Yeah, so um, the chicken was very thin and there was a the taste of honey on it. I should have read the description a little better. It was too sweet. I was hoping for that Nashville hot spicy, but I did love the jalapeno poppers. That were on the sandwich that on she took sandwich. off and ate separately. <laughs> yeah. The meatball I sub, the I really enjoyed. Yeah, it was good, your meatball sub. Absolutely. And the almond fingers. Sandy didn't like the cookies. Well, no, I liked the cookies. I didn't like, well, it was, let, me, let me just say, I did like it. It was just shocking, the taste of the lime, and it was very sour. Did you like it? Did you like the cookies? I didn't mind it at all. And what about your witch's cold brew that we got at the Cheshire Cafe, Sandy? 
Was that magical? It wasn't as magical as I've had in the past. I had to add a lot of sugar to it. It wasn't sweet at all like I like. So yeah, let's hopefully, I'm, I'm loving these like scoops of candy that we're getting in our bag. So we'll talk about that in a minute. That's so. right. Another can't miss is the parade. Oh, the parade. Yes. Also, the Pirates of the Caribbean. I love this ride. The parade has two times. Yep. And we always catch the late show because it seems to be less crowded. So enjoy our clips throughout the video. Can adults trick or treat out yes. here? Yes, 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 and yes. That's right, adults. At Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, they give you the bags, they give you the treats. Everybody Let's bags. load up. This line is not for an attraction. No ride, no characters. This is a line for candy. And it just keeps going. And going and going. Love these costumes. These are probably my favorites of the night right here. And the line goes and goes and goes. And when you find the end of the line, just look for her with the sign. Sandy, next year, I found our costume. Let's just be trim. we're on vacation like those. I love that costume. Nice, easy, breezy if it's hot. Yeah, let's go as Hawaiian vacationers, Sandy. I'll go shopping now for the outfit. Is Tron open during Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, Sandy? Yeah, and as a matter of fact, at 6 o'clock, you can go ahead and join the virtual queue. We got on group 150, but we're not sure exactly what time that means we're going to be able to ride. But we can ride! Yeah, so do not wait to 6.02 and try to start hitting for that virtual queue. Yep. I actually pulled up the atomic clock on the web yep. and just counted down to tell Sandy, hit the button, hit the button, hit the button, and Tron just went through there. Did you see that? I'm so excited. We got a lot more coming up. It is our turn and we actually get like a sunset, dusk type of ride. So that's gonna be pretty cool. I'm gonna point out. I'm gonna start this timer. I wanna know how many minutes of party time riding Tron is gonna cut out. Because we are in a boarding group, we're in virtual queue, so they did call our number, but we still have to take our, get our, put our stuff in our locker and get on the ride, and I wanna know, I'm curious, how many people are in line before us? Time to enter the grid. Wow. Tron is a great ride. Yeah, yeah, it is so much fun. I loved it. I did want to update everyone on the wait time, 45 minutes. Yeah. So just factor in if you want a 45 minute break from the party, because the party time moves so lightning fast. Yeah, but it's worth it because you can have the virtual queue. And again, 45 minutes, it's worth it.
trick or treat. Thank you so much. So down here by Tron, it's a, not a one, but a double treat station. Thank you. This bag's starting to get loaded. You're not seeing things. Barnstormer is a walk-on. That's one of the cool things about a party. Pirate Goofy is here. You see Prince Eric and Princess Ariel doing photos. be a challenge going on trick-or-treating out here that I wasn't aware of. Sandy has been asking for double scoops of the candy and That's you know what? Girl. They're giving it to her. Just one time. This time I was like, oh, I love tricks. Can I have a trick? But she didn't do a scoop. She just gave me one trick. So. All right. If in the comments, if you go to a scooper, candy scooper and go, I love Twix, let us know if you get two scoops or not like Sandy. I one She's been asking. Just to show you what it looks like with a Pinocchio house restaurant that is closed right now, unless you're in line for treats. Many treats, just like Sandy. Okay, I just tested this. I got two Twix. Sandy's getting full scoops of candy when she says it. What is Fred doing wrong? This is a great look. I have told you already, I only got one Twix. Oh no, yes. she's, she's been bragging about scoops. No, that's, that was the first time when I went to the other lady, I said, oh, can I have your scoop too? Oh, uh -huh. yeah, yeah, I got the scoop for you. She's getting lots of candy, more than me out here. No movies today, just candy. Should we really have to complete the maze for candy? You know, this trick-or-treating is missing one aspect. I have not, I have not knocked on a door once to say trick-or-treat. It's missing that well, little. I was waiting to get a Sprite. Someone decided to go hit that treat line again. And her bag is getting loaded a lot more than mine. However, I may have something in my bag that was given to me that Sandy may not get to see till the end. The Haunted Mansion at night. Look how spooky that looks, Sandy. It looks so cool. Uh, you can't miss if you're attending the Halloween party. Oh, yeah, you have to. Hi, everybody. Mm -hmm. Hi, welcome. Welcome back. Oh, yes. Welcome We've been back. lurking for you. That's right. Oh, oh, I love this outfit. Almost as though you sense a disquieting metamorphosis. Is this haunted room actually stretching?
here at Sleepy Hollow, you know we gotta go with the funnel cake with pumpkin ice cream. This Donald candy sipper even glows in the dark. How fun and is it? here it is, the pumpkin ice cream. I mean the cinnamon funnel cake, of course. And Sandy is already going right for the pumpkin ice cream. There is funnel cake, you know, Sandy. What are you thinking about it, Sandy? I'm loving this pumpkin ice cream. The pumpkin ice cream really does taste like pumpkin pie made into ice cream. Yeah. This is a winner. For sure. Yeah, and I like the butterscotch chips too that they have in there. It's like a great added flavor of all these different tastes. They have a special nighttime Halloween fireworks show just for the party. Let's check it out.
Looking for more fun photos and maybe little mini videos that we didn't include in this video you're watching now? Be sure to check out our TikTok, our Instagram, and our Facebook pages. And we're going to put those links also in the description down below.